bit of spare time tonight, so I'm going to go head out and take some photographs. Now, my original plan was that I'd go out uh, and take some seascapes, but I'll just check the weather forecast, and it's looking a bit grey and overcast, so I don't think there's going to be much in the way of uh, evening seascapes to be had. So I'm going to do something a little bit different, well, different for me anyway. So normally I would take this out. This is my Nikon D750, but I'm going to leave that at home tonight, and I'm going to take out this. This is my DJI uh, Phantom 3 4K. Now, I bought this uh, just at the start of uh, July, I think it was. Now, I originally bought it basically just as a summer uh, toy, a little plaything for me to have a bit of fun with on the holidays. Um, but since using it, I've kind of really got into it, and I've, I've started to see that there are some photographic opportunities um, to be had while I'm shooting with this device that obviously I wouldn't be able to get with my Nikon D750. Um, so tonight, I'm going to go out and shoot pretty well much exclusively with, with the drone. Um, the idea is I'm probably going to try and do lots of top-down shots. So that's a, the drone will be up high, camera will be pointing straight down. Um, as I said, the weather forecast isn't great, so sort of any sort of uh, background or uh, sky is, is probably not going to add much to the image. So I, I've tried this a couple of times and I've come up with some really interesting results. So I'm going to head down to the South Devon coast. Uh, I've, I've got some uh, cliff top locations uh, that I've recorded on my um, location map. So I'm going to head off there um, this evening um, and see what I can see what I can get. It should be quite interesting. Um, so why don't you come along and join me? So I've joined the uh, Southwest Coast Path now and I'm heading towards that hill behind me called High Peak. Um, it's got some really dramatic uh, coastline there. The cliffs drop off really sharply. There's lots of green vegetation that go all the way down to the water. So I'm hoping that's going to be my composition for today. So I'm just going to follow the path down and it should only take a few minutes to get there. I've had a bit of a walk. It's all, I'm almost there. Just got to get up the top of that hill back there. Um, and then we should be access to the uh, full coastline in view. So it's still raining, so um, just have to see. Hopefully, it'll pass by. So I've made it to the top of the hill, and uh, yeah, the weather's a bit bit on the bad side. Uh, you can see behind me, um, it's very cloudy. There's a lot of rain coming down. It's that fine misty rain stuff that gets stuff really wet really quickly. So there's no way I'm flying the drone at the moment. Um, but I'm going to hang about a bit longer, and I'm going to see if these showers pass. There are some clear uh, bits over to my to my left there. So hopefully they'll come through, and I'll be able to get the drone out. Um, if not, I'll have at least got out for a walk, so that's the way I always look at it. So um, let's hang fire and see what happens. Um, you may have noticed I've actually changed locations. I'm now down at uh, Ladrum uh, Bay. Uh, there's a caravan park down here, but the reason I'm down here is not for the caravans, it's for these sea stacks here. Um, I've been meaning to come here for a while actually and, and get an image, um, but since I was at the top of the hill and this wasn't far away while I was waiting for the weather to clear, I've taken a little uh, run down the hill to have a look. Looks really interesting. I'm not going to take any pictures today, not with the drone anyway, um, because it is a busy caravan park, it's peak season, there's lots of people about. The last thing I want to do is start buzzing a drone around this kind of area. So I'm going to head back up the hill uh, and do what I came to do and then shoot from the, the top of Peak Hill. So uh, give me five minutes, I'll be back up there, okay? <laughs> As you can tell, I'm a little bit out of breath after climbing that hill again. Maybe not my brightest of ideas, but it's good exercise nonetheless. Good news is, Weather's all cleared up, ish. Stopped raining at least, anyway. So I'm going to get the camera set up now. Uh, I'm going to try and get that shot. So here we go.
I've had the drone up now for about 15 minutes, so I'm almost out of battery. But the scene back there is, um, it turns out to be quite spectacular actually. The evening light along the coastline is absolutely phenomenal. I'm going to take a picture of it, and I know I didn't say I was going to take a, I was going to take pictures of things straight down. But the scene up there looks amazing, so I'm going to take some shots looking down the coast to see what they what they look like, how they all how they turn out in the drone. So that'll be quite interesting. And there's some probably won't be able to see it in the picture, but there's some um, cloud coming off the cliffs and, and flowing down the um, the cliffside. Something I've never seen before around here. So it's actually turned out to be quite an exciting evening, despite the uh, rainy conditions. So I'm going to get back to it. Okay. Actually, tonight has been turned out a lot better than I thought it was going to do, so it's in really good conditions. So I'm very excited about getting home, so that's what, exactly what I'm going to do now. And then um, I'm going to get those pictures processed and I'll put them up on the screen um, so you can have a look. Bye. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video on drone photography. It's definitely a really interesting area of photography for me and something I'm going to carry on looking into. Now, if you want to see those images in a bit more detail, I have put them up on my blog. Um, a link for that should be appearing up on the screen just now, uh, and I'll also put it in the notes below. Um, if you want to be notified when I uh, create new content, uh, please click on the subscribe button. And obviously, if you want to like, comment and share this video, I would really appreciate it. So until next time, bye bye.